Ah, good afternoon. Welcome. It's Wednesday, Wednesday afternoon, and I've just had a lovely shower, having been up that stepladder all afternoon, scraping, causing clouds of dust everywhere. Yeah, but not scraping, sanding. I mean sanding. That's what I mean. I've got the wide angle lens on, so I probably look like I'm on the back of a spoon at the moment. If it looks strange, I do apologise. Um, yeah, so I sanded down this afternoon. I'll just show you a little clip. So this is after one coat of paint on this wall here. And I think it's going to need probably three coats in total. Whew. But, you know, I'm getting there and I'm doing it, which is the main thing. And, yeah, I've put a coat of paint on. Yay, good, I'm getting there. And actually, it feels quite nice to do that room in sections. Like I said yesterday, that I'm doing that because it's, it's sort of easier and it's less hassle in terms of disruption, although... It's pretty disrupted in the house now. It's pretty messy. Um, but it's not as bad as clearing everything into the middle of the room and not being able to get anything out. You know, like plates and things and climbing over things to get to other things, stuff like that, you know. It's just easier this way. And actually, it's not as overwhelming because I think when you're faced with a whole room I certainly sort of think, oh, I can get all of this done in a day and I really go for it. And then I start splashing paint and spilling things and not being able to see what I'm doing because it's white on white, which is so difficult sometimes, especially if you've not got great lighting, which I haven't. I haven't got great task lighting. Actually, I could use a, I could use one of those, um, what are they called? You know, um, photography lights. I could use one of those, actually. They're really bright. Mm. Think on. Think on and look sharp. Anyway, so yeah, I was at work this morning, working from home. So once I'd finished that, I was straight on the decorating. What's that? Oh. I was straight on it, um, which is good. It feels good to achieve, but I just felt so filthy, filthy and gorgeous just a joke, um, that I thought I've got to have a shower, I've got to have a shower and get this dust before I go anywhere near that camera. So, yes, Wednesday. What else did I want to say? It's, it's really, well, it's been quite humid this morning, certainly, but it's so dry in terms of the ground. It's just bone dry. And I noticed when I went down to work, yesterday, that some of the leaves are coming off the trees already. I know, it's nowhere near autumn, but things are looking really tired. We've had so much wind, that's drying stuff up. And we've had lots of sun and no rain for what seems like ages, no significant rain. So yeah, things are struggling. I had to go out and water the garden earlier. By the way, the laurel hasn't gone yet. I think it's going to be tomorrow. So I cleared a few bits, but I'm not, you know, I'm not clearing my whole patio. They're going to have to be careful. Yeah, they are. And I shall have words if they're not. So, um, yeah, is there anything else to report? I don't think so. No, it's been a productive day, a good, you know, working day. I feel as though my arms are getting a bit of a workout. This hand, do you remember when I did that bit of parkour and fell off the wall? For those of you who don't know what parkour is, it's basically the art of jumping off structures onto other structures, very often at height, and it's a sort of sport. Well, I sort of went to take some ivy off the house, some dead ivy, and fell, and really pushed this hand, I think I said about it, 
it's still hurting. So I must have really, really damaged it. And that was like a month ago, I think. I think. So I think once things are sort of back to normal, I might get an x-ray just in case there's a, I don't know, a little break or something. It doesn't feel, I can move things without them hurting. You know, I can pull my fingers back and they don't hurt. That one does a little bit and I can move. So I don't think anything's broken, but I've certainly got a lasting injury. <laughs> oh, the beauty of age. It takes ages for things to heal these days. Sorry, I'm just looking at the light to make sure it's still recording. It is. <laughs> Wonderful. I'm trying a slightly different recording mode today. Sorry if I keep going cross-eyed. Um, I'm not used to looking at that screen. Yeah, I'm trying a different recording mode today, which is a slightly lower quality. Um, hopefully the file size won't be as big for rendering because it took ages yesterday to do that one at full quality and everybody said it looked clear. It did. It was beautiful, but unsustainable because my poor computer, it just, it kind of like grinds along. I can do this, but it's kind of, it's really struggling now. So that's next on the list. We've still got our little computer fund put away for that. And we've been investigating it. Earlier on today, in fact, we were looking at them. We're thinking of getting one built to spec because actually it works out cheaper. And there are several companies that do it. So um, that's what we're investigating at the moment. We need to be able to edit video quickly because it's such a thankless task, it really is. And it's kind of quite demoralizing when you get so far and it's just really not doing what it's supposed to do. So yeah, there you go, another bit of news. So I think I'm gonna go now, I think that's it. I think I've shared everything I need to share today. Have a good evening. I'm looking forward to something to eat and a good old relax now maybe a glass of something cold, an alcoholic, perhaps. We'll see what's in the fridge. Mm. Anyway, bye for now. Take care. See you tomorrow. And I hope you're all very well. Bye for now. Bye.